To the autumn winds that rain, the man upon the land would plant his crop. Harvest was a family toil amongst the tractors and the soil. Children working hard and feeling tough. Now you can hear the windmill squeak. Down beside that empty creek by paddocks that now have turned to dust. Not a cloud up in that sky, just loud thunder and the dry, fertile land which now looks like rust. Times are sad upon the land, all they need is a helping hand. Aussie produce now is under threat. It's affecting me and you. Appreciate the farmer's view. They're doing it tough up there on the farm. As, a, as an environment minister, I introduced laws that protected on private land, private farmland, uh, wetlands. Restricted what farmers could do in filling them in. We protected native vegetation and gave John Howard the right to boast about how Australia is achieving its greenhouse targets. There are restrictions on private property rights. You stick a right to property in your constitution and you have a conservative court say no governments can't place those restrictions on private landholders. Leave it to parliaments, leave it to a free society, don't congeal it in a final constitutional document or a statute like this. Here's another objection to the draft we've been provided with, this statutory Bill of Rights, and that's about property. And this is how the Conservatives You're would use with a, 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 bill of, a Bill of Rights. It says, no one shall be deprived of their property, pro property arbitrarily. There must be compensation paid. Well, that's an invitation for a Conservative-leaning court to strike down, for example, the measures that are protecting native vegetation on private farmlands. And neither the Queensland Government or the New South Wales Government pay compensation to farmers when they intervene to say you can no longer rip out your vegetation on these lands, it's having a hugely damaging environmental effect, it's contributing to the greenhouse crisis. And, and I, I reject the notion that we should shunt to judges the responsibility that should continue to reside with elected governments Namely, big land use to It's affecting me and you. Appreciate the farmer's view. They're doing it tough up there on the farm. They're doing it tough up there on the farm.